What's up, you legends? Welcome back to another episode. As always, if you are enjoying the series, please consider hitting subscribe for me, liking and commenting on the video. It does help a lot. We have been going ham on some bosses since we died, Corrupted Gauntlet and Zora specifically, and we have gotten some crazy drops. Here are the stats that we are starting this episode with, and I will see you in the next clip. All right, well, my punishment for dying will be getting a solo Dragon Warhammer, so I guess there is no better time to start than now, but man, I am still so bummed, but it will open up quite a bit of content for us, so there's that. Well, 86 range at Shamans. Getting quite up there now, honestly, but I'm probably going to sound like a deadbeat in all these clips for the next friggin' eight hours because... Yeah, I'm still quite pissed off. It's actually pretty decent range XP. Getting 50k an hour and 16k HP, HP XP. So, got to start looking at some positives. All right, well, I am going to buy a cannon with some money Choi has given me. And we are going to go to Shaman's, me and Outscale. Well, I don't have enough money, so I'm going to have to come back. All right, last piece of the cannon. There we go. Now we can go and do some shamans. All right, myself and Outskill are here. Let's see if we can get lucky, man. I need some luck on this account. I've had absolutely nothing and then died. Like, come on, give me the Dragon Warhammer and we'll call it even, Jagex, all right? How about that? So I am getting 68K range XP with this cannon here. I'm just thinking if we all came down here with cannons, this would actually be printing Dragon Warhammers because this is so much quicker. And he was like, I didn't die, cuz. Give me back my helm. <laughs> <laughs> Boxy, you got any of those spare lives laying around? <laughs> I seem to have misplaced mine. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so how's this, right? I had my cannon that we're using at Shaman's and left it down there, went up to the bank while Outska was doing something, and I went to buy him a second one because we're going to start running two cannons there. Traded him over the second one, went back down, and could not pick up my cannon, and... Tried to come back here after a despawn. Tried logging out, try everything. Can't get it again. He's like, you have to buy a new one. So we just got scammed. 750k for nothing. Um, if you know what's happened here, put it in the comments because I have no idea. But anyway, if there's a way we can get it back, that'd be nice. Then we'll have three cannons. Wait, wait. What, I just came back in the weirdest time. What did you just say? <laughs> Boxy said when he um, has too many pan Panadols, his farts smell weird. And I said, when I have a Panadol, my burps fucking they smell all right. And he's like, you weird cunt. <laughs> <laughs> fucking serious. <laughs> all right, here we go. Running two cannons now. Let's see what the kills are like with the two of them running, even though we got scammed for one of them. But that's just how our luck goes on this account, isn't it, boys? Now we're going to get a Dragon Warhammer to make up for it. She's <laughs> just like, this isn't fair. <laughs> He's like, I have literally not kissed the dirt. <laughs> Yet I have a blue helmet. <laughs> yeah. So weird I've numbers. I've not died <laughs> and I've lost all my life. I had four, didn't die once, and now I have none. <laughs> I just can't quite figure it out, to be honest. Oh no, another D-Med, bro. Alright, that is all the Lizard Machamans I'm going to do tonight. I have done 565 in one sitting. Used about 4k cannonballs. And it took me 3 hours, so... I'll pop up my loot tracker on screen now and show you guys the loot that I got. But we did not get the one thing that I wanted. Alright, hard clue from Shamans. Let's see what we get. Ancient page four. Okay, not bad. All right, that is Shaman's done for now. I have no cannonballs left and I literally got half a range level there. So that's not too bad. And look at this, the cash that I made almost two mil in that session. That was about 613 lizard man shamans I've done with those cannonballs. So, well, I'll tell you one thing, running through the wildy does not have the same effect as it did once before, but we are heading off to do Major Arena 1 and maybe Major Arena 2, depending on how much time I have. So at least I can do this now. Well, there is Major Arena 1 completed. 
Sarakate best in slot, as always, boys. All right, let's go and do Major Arena 2. Okay, so I have finished casting all three spells inside the arena 100 times, so now I can start Major Arena 2. All right, there's the first one. All right, there's the second one. All right, there's the third one. Let's go get the cape. All right, let's hand in the Sarah cape. Oh, baby. I need to take this staff off. There we go. <laughs> Look at her. The best in slot cape gonna be unreal at Zora and raids something I wouldn't have done as a hardcore but didn't even see one PK so how it goes all right this is what I've ended up with a long session on the cannonballs while I was editing the video and I am out for blood baby I am getting that dragon war hammer watch this space I'm gonna go send off some shamans now and then me and outskill are gonna go and do some demonics later well there is 62 herb lore Making some prayer pots. All right, here is another Hespori KC. And nothing. Oh, the teak seeds though, not bad. There is 71 farming on the morning farm run. Shout out to OutSchool for going to LMS and getting me a magic shortbow scroll. I can't believe I've been doing everything without this this whole time, but uh, no longer. All right, we are back at Shaman's. Gonna send these off for an hour or so and see if we get lucky. Well, just about 70kc in that trip and nothing to show for it. All right, finally got around to doing the last medium Balador diary step. There we go. Let's go and get our lamp. Pop that into Herblore. And we are done. All right, guys, it is time for me to take on Zora for the first time. This is the equipment that I am using. Don't know how it's going to go. Um, need one kill for the diary, but if it is doable, I might try and do a few more. So let's see how the first one goes. All right, there we go. First Zora kill. And nothing really, but that was very clutch, honestly. All right, there's another kill. And nothing really again, but good scales. God, that was a long kill for absolutely nothing. We got it. Antidotes? Oh, we take those. <laughs> Yo, Zora teleports and tree seeds. That's actually a really good drop. I like that one. That's the longest kill I've done so far. Five minutes, 18. Wow. Fuck, that was clutch. God, that was close. That is the worst drop I've ever seen in my life. Well, more teleports and manta rays. All right, I like this shot. One of the better ones. That is the worst drop you can ever get. The worst. That is 20 KC at Zora. And nothing to show for it. Ooh, some more teleports. Thank you. More Manta Rays. Come on, man. Have a day off. If you guys are wondering how I'm doing Zora, I am only doing the third phase. So only when the green guy pops up second, it's pretty much the only way I can kill it at this level with this gear. I'm using Lunar Spell Book to heal myself from Venom. And I'm hiding behind pillars as well on some of the blue phases so I don't take too much damage. All right, so as you guys know, Choi and Boxy have just been sending Corrupt Gauntlet like there's no tomorrow. They've been going ham on it, doing that many KC, and we 
have actually gotten that many crystal armor seeds and weapon seeds lately. It's insane. I'm going to pop up Choi's collection log now, and there's a clip of Boxy getting an armor seed as well. So the boys are absolutely killing it and stacking us with cash, which we really need to buy stats and progress our account. So insane work from the boys. All right, guys. So I just took a break from Zora to do a little bit of admin stuff. So I've just finished doing all the Karen favors, which means I can now actually do the architectural alliance quest, which means that I can do the hard diary. So at some point today, I am going to get this diary down. All right, finished architectural alliance, got the XP lamp, chuck that into Herb Law, and now I should be able to teleport to the middle of Karenda, which is nice, and that is needed for the diary. All right, another fishing level. While I'm editing a video, you love to see it. So I ended up heading back to Zora for about another 10kc and I didn't really get anything but I am getting good money and supplies that I need for the account. I'm going to pop up my loot tracker from the KC I've done so far and I'm going to head back to Zora in a little bit and keep going. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you have made it this far, please consider subscribing to the channel, liking and commenting. Here are the stats that we are finishing this episode with. And on the next one, we are be going to be going absolutely ham on some more bosses. So I'll catch you guys in the next episode.